wasn't expecting you till tomorrow. Ah, uh, well, I was just drove and drove non-stop. I was anxious to getting rid of that thing. Yeah. Glad to take him off your hands, Hill. Fitting quite nicely around here. Well, good. Uh, yeah, then if you get me the money, then uh, he'll be all yours. Maybe we should uh, take him off the truck and have a look, make sure we're, uh, we're getting everything we paid for. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. That, that, that thing ain't going nowhere. Nowhere till I get paid. Look, you, you're getting way more than you bargained for here. Just, just trust me on this, okay? It's all there. Plus a little extra for your prompt and discreet service. Thank you very much. You know, uh, I got you a couple of tranquilizer guns. Because he can be a mean son of a bitch. Oh, we didn't have ourselves. <laughs> All right. Fine. I need you to dump the body. Safe. Now, tranquilizer should keep me quiet. Let's get him out of here. Okay. Come on now. Come on, little buddy. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. That's it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Chen. Yes, it's me, yes. Uh, well, I've got it. Oh, yes, he's very much alive. No, no, don't worry, I won't let anything happen to her. No, no trouble at all. So it'll happen in a week. Excellent. Well, uh, I'm sure he will be a very unique addition to your collection. Morning, Luke. Morning, Sheriff. This must be the abandoned vehicle, huh? Yeah, under about a half mile down Haystack Road. It's an awful bitch getting out of the mud. I don't know why anybody had barked there anyways. Very odd. Very odd. Way back, too. Nothing more than a goat trail now. Big vehicle like this. Oh! Sure does stink like something's dead. Here, let's get this open here. Whoa! Interesting. Could be something. Huh. Jersey plates. Well, what do you think? All right. Take her around back and see what I can dig up. You got it, Sheriff. 
Of course, Pastor. Absolutely, you're right. They should. Absolutely. Yes, Pastor. But it is just a little show, after all, and I'm sure they're quite harmless. Well, I don't really... Yes, Pastor. Oh. Okay, then. I'll let him know. Any word on who owns that truck? Nope. Out of state plates. Strange just to have been here like that. Uh, yes, Pastor. I was listening. Oh, like I said, uh, I'll let him know how concerned you are. Very good, then. Good pastor again. What is it this time? Well, he's seen these posters around town for the Carnival's Freak Show, and he's he's worked up. Well, he's always trying to save this town from something. Been that way for as long as I can remember. Yeah, this is different. And he's really seeing red over these freaks coming to town. Huh. Well, I'll tell you what. If he calls back again, you tell him I went over there to check him out. Need to make sure their permits are in order anyway. Uh, you want me to run the plate? Yeah. It's out of state, so it may take a while, but uh, rush it through as much as you can. Rely on Sheriff's Department. You know, uh, it's amazing you just missed him, Pastor. I know. Well, he's going over there right now to talk to them about it. Yes, Pastor. Something. Yeah. Uh. Sorry. Could you tell me where I could find the owner? I don't see him around. Must be in his trailer. It's over there. You want me to show you? No, that's, uh, that's all right. I got a partner. Appreciate it. No. Just 
Looking for the owner? But you won't find him back here. All right, then. You have a good day now. Excuse me. Hi. I'm uh, really hoping you can help me out here. I'm looking for the owner. Oh, you must mean Cap. Mr. Caprini the most. But uh, my close friends call me Cap. What can I do for you, sir? Well, Mr. Caprini, uh, officially I need you to stop by and make sure all your permits are in order. But to be honest, I just wanted to get a closer look at what you're up to here. Looks like you brought quite the show to town. I'm not sure the good people of Reliance have ever seen anything like this before. I can guarantee you that they haven't. We're a dying breed, sir. We are a mesmerizing gallery of misfits. Human oddities and freaks, if you will. We are the mysteries that lurk within the shadows of society, put on display for all to see. Oh, well, surely this can't all be real. There's no sleight of hand here, sir. What you see? Is what you get. Take, take Samara here. As beautiful as she is gifted, her visions have proven true time and time again. Give you a hand, Sheriff. Let's see what the future has in store. <laughs> it's all right. Come on, Sheriff. He doesn't bite. <laughs> what? Nothing. Sometimes the visions are unclear at first. You must be a busy man. Let's go take a look at those permits. So, you'll be coming for opening night out? Oh, I'm sure it's safe to say that everyone in town is going to be here tonight. Fantastic. God's greatest abomination. <laughs> that sounds quite ominous. That's a new addition to our show. Come. You mind? No. Not at all. The devil himself, huh? Huh? Oh, that's quite a clown. Oh, please, Sheriff, allow me, allow me. It's quite harmless, I assure you, but easily spooked. God, what the hell is that? We're not quite sure. Freak of nature, obviously. Say that again. I'm sure it'll prove to be a crowd pleaser. Is he safe? Oh, absolutely, Sheriff. We keep him heavily sedated and secured. It's no different than a cage lion or tiger, really. Really? Well, I'm sure he's going to be a big hit with the folks around town. Yes, sir. -y. Speaking of which, I ought to get back. Mm -hmm. Would you mind dropping off those permits at the station? Yeah, I'll have Quinn run them over. Say, did you guys get a truck stuck in the mud just outside of town? Jersey plates? No, I don't think so. Certainly not with those plates. So, we can expect you at the uh, opening. Bet on it. All right. Thanks for coming by. Sorry, I uh, I took the other ones down. They must have put more up. Want well, me to get rid of these? No, no. We haven't got any time to waste. The heathens mustn't be allowed to stay in our town. I'll, I'll see to that. The sooner we get the word out, the better. I'll do my best. No, I'm counting on you, Taylor. Your work here today is essential. We must get the people to hear the truth. I'm counting on you to get people to come to the service. Get as many as you can. Go door to door if you must. Oh. Son. I 
I cannot waste another moment. Our town's very soul hangs in the balance. such a rush. Perry's, remember? Hmm. You're not going to the carnival? Mm, nah. Those things are usually pretty lame, so. That Taylor Owen isn't going to be there? No, Mom. You know that pastor's son is nothing but trouble. I know, Mom. Bye. Have fun. Be careful. Very funny. You need a lift? Dude. You should have seen your face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Lighten up. A drink. Courtesy of the good pastor himself. Hypocrite. Hey, uh. Courtesy of my mother uh, and her fine eating establishment. Well, well, well. Might be hope for you yet, Jess. Ah, a drink to a uh, devil of a good night <laughs> under my father's nose. And so, my dear friends, it is with great sadness that our town, our beloved, God-fearing town, is being besieged by this sinful carnival. Oh, no. Now... We all know what they bring. They bring the devil's work. Writing. Games of chance. Yeah, People yeah. twisted and abhorrent to God Almighty. Things which can only lead down the path to damnation. Pastor sure getting them fired up over there. He certainly didn't waste any time. No. I've seen him worked up before, but nothing like this. Those permits to check out? Yeah, they're on the counter there. Everything's in order. If there's a snake, it'd have bit me. Well, I'm heading over there. You coming? Uh, on hold to the DMV in Jersey. Looks like those plates might have been stolen. Turning into quite the little mystery. Finally a chance to do some real police work around here. Be careful what you wish for there, Davy. All right, see you over there. Yes, uh, yes, I'll hold. These sinners who work in this abomination, these freaks as they call themselves, we must bring them to God, we must save their souls. It is our duty to bring them to the light. Hallelujah. 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 Give me a break. No way. 
What's that God's greatest abomination? Mr. Owen? Mr. Rose? I'll take that. Come on, Sheriff. Leave the kids alone. You just take care of the tickets. I'll take care of the law. I hardly think your parents would approve, especially yours, Taylor. Come on, Sheriff. Cut us a break. We just want to enjoy the show. Behave yourselves. And I'll be keeping this. <laughs> Go on in. No charge. Thanks. But you, pay. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, what you're about to see will terrify you. Will send chills down your spine. It will give you nightmares for weeks to come. If any of you are not up to this fright, please leave now. The door is right there. What we have standing behind this curtain in a steel reinforced cage is something so shocking that even God himself has turned a cold shoulder. Cast down from heaven, here with us, we have Satan's child, born of pure evil. Enough heaven and hell crap. If I want to hear about Satan's child, I would have stayed home. Patience, boy. This is a beast to be reckoned with. <laughs> What'd I say, Taylor? You see my assistant, Quinn? He didn't pay the devil the proper respect, but he paid for it with his eye. The creature is not of this world, so we ask that, for your own protection, everyone remain absolutely still. Himself. That's the devil. Please. Sorry, <laughs> right, folks. Sorry. Right. Don't worry. He's in a he's in a solid steel cage. Nothing to worry about. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't so tough. Just did it! Hey, slow up! Oh, I need to catch my breath. You see the way that thing ripped out of there? I'm lucky no one was killed. Dude, my father must be losing his mind. Hey, give me a drink. You know, I don't think we should be hanging around out here, okay? Who knows where that thing flew off to? Dude, you're such a wuss. That thing is long gone. Well, let's at least get out of the open. That's my man! You lead the way. There is nothing to fear, but fear itself. Now, oh, my two hands. Oh. Tomorrow. You all right? A little shaken up. I'll be fine. Looks like quite a few of your friends are leaving. This is not easy for us. The carnival is our home, where we feel safe, and now this. Sure. I'll let you work. Okay. How are we looking? Well, a few cuts, bruises, and broken bones, but nothing too serious. I'm telling you, David, we got off lucky. 
I got a good look at that thing. This thing could have been a whole hell of a lot worse. Sheriff, Sheriff. Uh, let's get everybody out of here quick as we can. You're going after that thing, right? I got my rifle in my truck, I have my dog here in a flash. You just say the word. And that right now, hey, Luke. Just get yourself home. Sheriff. Well, I mean, it's best to hunt, uh, hunt the thing down now, no? Luke, home. Sheriff. You know what's best, right? I've been looking for you. A little busy right now, Pastor. If you had heeded my wishes, none of this would have happened. Owen, now is not the best time for this. Like another person from this town is harmed by that, that thing, I will hold you personally responsible. Now, if you can't do the job, I'll have to take matters into my own hands. Loud and clear. Mr. Caprini, until further notice, this carnival is shut down. That's wholly uncalled for. No, sir. You told me that creature was safe. You assured me. Now, what the hell happened? There's no need to assign blame. No one was seriously injured. I'm certainly you want the same thing we all do, a safe conclusion to this matter. That creature needs to be put down. Sheriff, please, please. The creature is harmless. He was just frightened. That's all. He's become an invaluable part of this carnival. And we've got to get him back here without harm. Just let us go get him, all right? You can do what you want. But come daybreak, I'm going after that thing. We can't let that hick sheriff kill the best thing we got going. Do you have any idea how much money Chen's willing to give me for that monster? Us, Cap. Yes, give yes, us. Yes, give us. And I don't care what we need to do, but we've got to get that monster back here alive. Alive. What are you doing? What does it look like? I'm leaving. Leaving? You can't go now. I need your help. This isn't going to end well, Cap, and I don't want any part of it. What are you doing? Who took you in when you had nowhere else to go? Who gave you a home? Who treated you like family when everyone else out there was treating you like you were nothing more than some sideshow freak? I raised you like you were my own. You owe me. Please. I'll stay long enough to help you catch it. But then I'm gone. Thank you. Thank you. I'll need something from it. Or at least something it touched. Thank you. Dude, that scared the crap out of me. It's okay, boy. It's okay. It's okay. Good boy. Oh, good dog, huh? 
Good dog. This dog has blood on his face. Dude, look. Oh my god. Is that a foot? Do you, do you think he brought that in here? injured itself when it hit the Ferris wheel. This will do just fine. Just put it in. It wouldn't get hurt too bad. Your hope seems odd in this place, even for you, Cap. That creature's the only hope this carnival has left. You may be able to fool the others, but please don't waste your false sentiments on me. I don't have time for this now, not tonight. Tell me what you see. Rope. Waves. Broken heart. Rope. Waves. A broken heart. Rope, waves, and a broken heart. What the hell does that mean? How am I supposed to figure anything out from that? I don't control my visions. Well, we help you, man. Glad you decided to stick around. Oh. The sheriff. Earlier. What'd you see? 
I saw death. Pastor Owen just came in. He said Taylor didn't come home last night. Well, what should I tell him? Don't tell him anything until we figure out what's going on. And keep him there. I'll get back to you when I know something. Sure thing. Boy just comes stumbling out of the woods. I almost hit him, Mr. Sheriff. He didn't say a word. I imagine it's that thing escaped from the carnival last night to done this, I guarantee. Jesse, you all right? You need to tell me what happened, bud. Jesse, you with me? This is a bridge. This is a stream. Which bridge? Where? The bridge. Kill me, man. The way he was screaming it. He's dead. It was a kill that I couldn't. Who, Jesse? Who did he kill? He ripping the bridge apart. Okay. Okay, man. All right. Where'd he come out of the forest? Uh, he come out over there. All right, take it easy with that thing, huh? No worries. Rogers, you there? Rogers! Sheriff, this is Rogers. Is everything okay out there? Not even close. Jesse's okay, but... We got two bodies on our hands. All right. If the hospital in Pine Ridge can send someone out to take a look at it. You sure you don't want the rifle, Sheriff? No, fine. Just get him into town. It'll be long as soon as I can. Suit yourself.
Pastor? Oh, please tell me to. Pastor Oates, I think maybe you ought to sit down. Like hell I will. Sir? Is that my boy? Sorry. Oh. Oh. Leonard, please. I'm sorry, Owen. I truly am. How dare you? We trusted you. You gave me your word, and now my son, my, my only son. This is your fault. If you'd listened to me, if you'd heeded my words. Pastor, it's not the sheriff's fault. Don't you patronize me! I told you they brought the devil. And they surely have. And they will pay. Pay dearly. Owen, I can only imagine how much you're suffering, but... Taylor is with God now. And I promise you that before this day is out, those freaks will learn what it means to suffer. No, he's just blowing off some steam. I'll check in with him later. Grab some evidence bags. Let's get this over with. for this will be. They will pay for this dearly. <laughs> this thing is vicious. I don't think so. You don't think so? and rip this guy to pieces. No, I don't think this was our beast. <sighs> Take a look at this wound here, Davy. This arm wasn't ripped out. It was cut. I don't understand. This one done by any animal. Someone took a saw to this poor bastard. What the hell is going on? damned if I know, but I think we may have found the driver of our abandoned van. Our devil got a hold of somebody, tore him up. Real good. Uh, sheriff's not gonna take too kindly to his forest being littered with townfolk. Oh no. What? 
What? Oh, no, what? I think this might be where I dumped our friend. What? I mean, maybe it's not him. I can't be sure. It was dark. I threw him as far out into the water as I could. I'm sorry. Maybe I should have cut him into smaller pieces. Oh! I got to get back into town. Samara left word this morning about something she'd found. You gonna be okay out here by yourself finishing this up? Yeah, sure, you go. I got this. Sure about that? Yeah, I got it. You didn't have to go and do that. Well, I didn't have to cut you on this deal either. What was I thinking? Trusting you to do something as complicated as dumping a body? I don't want to get in with no murder rap. Maybe we should leave this town while we can. Uh, without the beast? Do you know how much Jen is willing to pay us for it? Well, if you want to go without your cut of the money, be my guess. No, I didn't think so. Where'd you find this? These are books that belong to my grandmother. She was fascinated by anything that didn't belong. Oddities like her and myself. Legendary creatures said to be the cursed 13th child of Mrs. Leeds, who in 1735, upon hearing she was again pregnant, swore that if she had yet another child, may he be the devil. Upon birth, the child quickly transformed into a hellish creature, killing the midwife before disappearing into the Pine Barrens Forest of New Jersey. Its exceptional sense of smell allows it to track and hunt its prey from miles away. It's drawn to blood, human or otherwise. And listen to this. While some refer to it as the Leeds Devil and others as the Jersey Devil, they all agree that it is motivated by intense rage, and the more it kills, the greater its desire for blood. go home. We are not going back there until that thing is dead and gone. And if the rest of the town had any sense, get the hell out of there too. Can we go straight to Aunt Mary's then? After the doc checks you out. Honestly, Jess, you're lucky to be alive. I could have just as easily been you out there. Lord. I, yeah, I don't want to talk about it right now. Okay? I just don't understand what you and Taylor were doing out there in the first place, especially after you promised me. You promised me you weren't going to be hanging out with him anymore. That boy has been trouble ever since the first day you set well, eyes dead. on him. All right, mom, he's dead. Isn't that enough? Oh, Jess, I'm so sorry. I'm just so glad you're alive. I love you so much. Jess, you're my baby boy. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Excuse me, guys. Everyone present and accounted for? Yes, sir. Uh, everyone, thanks for coming. You ready, Sheriff? No way this thing can hide from old Bo here. He's gonna tear it a new one. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's great, Luke. But listen, now. I want all of you to be careful out there. This isn't some ordinary animal we're going after. Injured, it's pissed off, and it's got a real taste for blood. So watch yourselves. That said, it's just flesh and blood. It might look like the devil, boys, but it bleeds. And if it bleeds, we can kill it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we're going to divide up into groups. Uh, see John, Josh, Glenn, you take your boys out to the old Willow Road, all right? Uh, Brian, Jeff, Rich, you guys start out by county line, all right? Luke, you with me and Davey. I don't want any heroes out there. Anyone finds anything, get on the radio. All right? Let's get this thing done. Blood is dead. It's killed. Murdered. Blood from our midst before his time. Taylor was a good boy. A kind and righteous soul who suffered at the hands of these sinners. Why did he have to die? Why? Because we are at war. A war that has raged since the beginning of time. A war between right and wrong. A war between good and evil. A war between God and the devil. Here, seek now, seek! No. We can take comfort in knowing that God looks out for the righteous as long as we abide by his ways. Follow his words, do his bidding. Yet evil walks among us not in some distant land not in some faraway place evil walks on the very earth that we try and farm here every day we cannot we will not we dare not sit idly by and allow sin to continue eating at the very belly of this good and just town carry god's will upon your shoulders and inside your hearts and let's cast these sinners into the wind! Where are you going? seen a spook like this, Sheriff. Yeah, I know. I feel it. I best, I best take him home. Huh? That's fine, Luke. Where to, boss? Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. Come with me. Come on. Come.
Son of a bitch! Now hang in there, man. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I thought he was that thing. What the hell are you guys doing out here? Give me that! The same as you, hunting our animal. But do I look like that thing? If you've got no business being out here, especially now with a damn loaded weapon. You're right, Sheriff. We're just trying to help. Oh, some help. All right, buddy, this might hurt. Okay. <coughs> ah! That's, that's all right. We'll, we'll give my hand back to town. No. Thank you. I'll get him back by myself. No. No, you stay here and find that thing. It's so close we can get it. You keep that tight. You got me? Yeah, don't worry about me. I'll be all right. We can't afford to let that thing get away. Terribly sorry. Sir. Terribly sorry. You be careful with him. Yes, sir. Excuse me. Come on. Go ahead and grab him right here. Take that. All right. Let's easy, easy. One. Oh, no, no, no. We need to keep going. Look, we're just, we're almost there. It's just over there. See? The man needs to rest. The man needs to rest. Yeah, but we're almost... The man needs to rest. I just need to... Put me over here. Yeah. Put me over here. Yeah, give me up. Put me down. Okay. Uh, 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 Attack before we could do anything. And this damn thing has no effect on it anymore. Back in the town.
Mr. Sheriff Atlas, uh, has the coroner shown up there yet? No. No, I can't wait until then. I'm gonna come over and take a look myself. No, I got some keys. I'll let myself in. Thanks. A little busy at the moment. Yes, well. Tomorrow it is. What's all this? Those damn tranquilizers weren't worth anything. I put enough drugs into these. To put an elephant to sleep for a week. Have you figured out Samra's vision yet? Clint, don't bother yourself with such complicated things. You know you're not good at that. Leave it to me. I'll recognize the signs when I see them. Right, yep. He's coming this way. Uh, if he's within five miles, he'll smell the blood and come running. What blood? Doing this to me. Sam. Sam. For once in your life. Sam. This yeah. wasn't part of the visions. Yes. Oh, oh. It is. Oh. We have the rope. And now waves. This. My list. We need the broken heart.
one of the trucks and get some chains. Lots of chains. I got him trapped. I need help holding them up. That's very good news. I'd be glad to give you a hand with that. Sure. Hey, Startle me. What are you doing here? What did you say? You trapped it? I can't say for sure, but I know I'll be able to find my way back. Now, you see, there may be a problem with that. How's that? I found part of a tranquilizer dart in the back of my deputy's neck. <sighs> What are you doing? I'm arresting you for murder. What? Let's go. Oh. Please, Jared, it's not my fault. Let me explain. It was an accident. He just got in the way. Please, please. He just got in the way, that's all. I'm sure he did. Just like the man who brought you that thing, and just like everyone else who stands in your way. What are you doing? You crazy? This is my fault, you know. I have no control over that animal. Speak not! For judgment day is upon us. Judgment day. Judgment day. When the evil and the wicked shall face God Almighty and pay for their transgressions. No, 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 listen here. You can't blame me for everything. I'm sorry. Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about your son. The devil speaks with a fork pot. And cannot be trusted.
shall deliver judgment upon the wicked. Rolling. Heard that beast was back around. Figured I'd bring a little more firepower with me this time. <laughs> in fear. No more. I have slain the creature. The very devil that murdered my boy. I best check this out. The devil is dead. But the true source of this evil is still within our midst. Sideshow freaks. Twisted and abhorrent in the eyes of God. They are the real evil. They are the ones that brought the beast into our town. They are the ones who are responsible for setting it loose among us. And for that, they must answer to God Almighty. And we must be the messenger. You killed it. You hear that? He slain the beast that killed his boy. Now we must be God's hand and deliver judgment upon those horrid and vile souls. The very ones which brought so much death and destruction into our lives. Now we must burn it and send it down into the depths of hell along with those who protected it. We gotta drag this beast out here onto the street right. and give it to them who brought it to us. Yeah. Yeah. Who's with me? Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, that's good! Woohoo! Look at you, ain't so tough now! Flynn, hey, still got that old camera from our hunting trip? Truck. We'll get it. Get some pictures of me with this ugly thing before we burn it and eat it. <laughs> How'd that look? Huh? That look good? Yeah, okay. That's a couple more now. Yeah. Yeah. Not so tough now, huh? <laughs> Sir. Yeah? That's good, right? You get my gun in there? You got everything? Good, yeah. Get this bad boy up, huh? You're not so tough now, huh? Yeah, you got that? <laughs> Burn it. Tonight, the carnival and the beast must burn! You must not allow sin to go unpunished. Burn it all to the ground! Burn their tents! Burn their trailers! Burn the heathens themselves! You heard them, boys! 
You go get that gasoline now. We're gonna have ourselves a barbecue. Woo Come on! Come on now! Wakey, wakey, Get going! I'm gonna set this place on fire. Yeah? There you go, Carnies! Hey! There we go! You want more? Yeah! Burn, baby! That'll learn ya! Come on! Come on! This is for you, my son. Let it be known that in the eyes of God Almighty, you did not die in vain. The flames of righteousness shall cleanse this evil once and for all. burning the whole thing's burning just like you said come have a look
Samara. Samara. Please. Please. As that big red sun goes down Got time ain't no time to be around In this God forsaken town Yeah, the moon is as cold as the blood in your veins Every nightmare you've had could come true And you hope that that flutter is only your heart There's only one thing left to do 